The weather works like a pendulum, you know that, right? So when it gets really cold and snowy, usually it warms up with some rain, and that's where we are now. The rain has just moved offshore. It's a Monday cast uh, because of the holiday, and there's a holiday storm. It looks like a nor'easter, but it's initially warm, so it's going to start off as rain, except for at some of the mountain tops. It's not going to be an exceptionally big storm, but uh, in some spots it'll be the heaviest snow so far this season. Blue Hill. Massachusetts has already had uh, five to six inches of snow, making another five to six. But it looks like uh, northern Connecticut to Wauwachusett to Sunday River probably getting the most snow out of this. Could be 10 to 15. That's kind of a high side estimate. And then once we get north to, say, Killington, go up Route 100 through Vermont, a few inches of snow, more towards Mount Snow, uh, more towards Hunter. Is Hunter even open yet? Uh, that's sort of the western edge of this storm. Uh, Ontario's been getting it, uh, Michigan's been getting it, and there'll be some more sort of lake effect snow coming in afterwards. But uh, this storm looks like it's going to be heaviest late Wednesday, so travel before Wednesday noon if possible, and then Thursday, Thanksgiving Day. Are the ski areas open? There'll be a few fresh inches of snow, especially in those aforementioned places from central Connecticut to southern central Maine. And it looks like it's going to be dry and nice. Not too windy on Thanksgiving afternoon. There'll be snow showers. There's another sort of clipper coming down. Uh, that one's going to be uh, diffuse. It's going to bring some snow uh, to Michigan and Pennsylvania, maybe West Virginia, and swing through Vermont with a little upslope snow. New cold air coming in on Saturday. It's a highly amplitude flow. There's a lot of uh, energy up in the Pacific Ocean. And after a fairly quiet weekend with good snow making weather. Next week there looks like there's going to be another storm similar to what's going on now. That is, uh, we may have a, a burst of warmth uh, early next week followed by more uh, sort of rain to snow and it's a very active pattern. But we're in pretty good shape for our Thanksgiving. The area is going to be resurfacing with the nice cold air that comes in uh, beginning on Tuesday night. So an extended period of wintry weather. We'll see you at the slopes. They're playing it. I'm just recording. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a white one. I had no other outtakes, what can I say? <laughs> 